Do you see where we are? This is beautiful. Well, this is great. Rain, rain, rain. Then even the ducks wouldn't come out in weather like this. But me, I'm an idiot. every day I've been doing it for a few weeks but you know it's just not cool but I'm not gonna let me hold me down the man can't hold me down <laughs> Your turn. <laughs> Dang it. Guys, we are straight up in a rainforest right now. Raleigh, what's the fact about this rainforest? Raining. It's a forest. Northwestern United States. Rainforest. That's a thing. We're enjoying it. We're it's gonna, raining. And we're going to see the world's biggest spruce. <laughs> How do they know it's the world's largest? Then you have to shout to the tree. We are at Ruby Beach and it's super beautiful and vampires live here. This is where Twilight was filmed. Well, I don't know if it was at Ruby Beach, but we're right next to Forks, which is where Twilight was filmed. So it's a pretty big place. Some of our cameras can't get wet, so <laughs> can't even see me. Oh! Trying to record and not get the camera wet. Guys, oh, this place is so cool. It's like logs upon logs upon logs upon rocks upon vampires. Found more logs. Because the ocean, you can't even see me. Ocean just brings it all in. So it's pouring rain outside of this rock here. I'm like under this overhang. There's a little doorway here, and then over me is just pouring rain. I don't know if you can tell. Pouring rain. I've had two cliff bars today. I haven't showered. I did shower this morning. I'm a little cold, but I'm happy. It's so nice to just get outside and like truly pause life take time to be with those that you love. Billy and I are having a blast here. It's hard to believe we literally came from Mexico all the way up to the peak of Washington right now. We've had some amazing experiences. There's been stressful times. We haven't had lodging or a campsite or all the hotels were booked. That was a real thing. We slept in our car, had some other expenses that came up. But for the most part, we've stayed in our budget. We've grown closer together. We really have because back home, we would work during the week and then go on adventures on the weekends, right? All of the adventures you've seen of us so far have been weekend getaways. But it has been weeks that it's just been us together with the Nortons. That's awesome. We've become even better friends from that. And that's real. Here we are just totally entertained. Nels is over here. She's getting video of the Nortons. This is rad. We're learning a lot of how to get an income while on the road. We have other businesses besides our YouTube channel and our website. Anyone else who wants to be able to do this, reach out to us. We're not experts, we're barely making it, but we're making it. And we can share with you what we're learning and what we've learned from the ruckus list and from the Nortons. And uh, you should do this. So. If you don't have a vacation planned, plan one now, even if that's just a day. 
where you are not doing anything but spending time together outside at this location, you should always have something to look forward to because that's when you really live. When you have something to live for is when you really live, more than just the nine to five. Hey guys, so when you come out from the parking lot, there'll be a trail and you go all the way down until you see this little fort. Here we go, right. Start seeing the ocean and some cool logs. You're gonna bury it. In there. Hopefully you can grab it, because I don't know if I can right now. I put it under the log, right in there. So you find the treasure, you're gonna post a picture or a video. Hashtag we the adventure and tag the jerky so we know you got it so we can send you your treasure. There's a spider, do you see that? You want to find this treasure because you want to be adventurous and inspiring. It's a surprise treasure, it's our adventure treasure. So you won't know until you get it, but it's the ultimate adventure package. So you're gonna want it. So come get it at Ruby Beach where the vampires live. That's all I got for you. Nelly's just been telling me how Twilight took place in Forks. I was like, why does everyone know that? How do they, but it's in the books, apparently. You gotta read the books. We just passed a sign that said vampires beyond this point. I feel like we're gonna see like a fake vampire in a tree, you know, for all the tourists. Doesn't she have a vampire in her stomach? Yeah. Her womb? Not in her, she didn't eat but it. She, she birthed Babies it. aren't in your stomach. She actually birthed the baby, <laughs> ripped open. It did? No, I think that was the baby. Oh. oh. It started punching through. She didn't like birth it. Like, it ate through her stomach. It ate through her stomach. Just, it know. was like growing and like cracking her ribs and she was dying. And so I think they, they cut her up and got her out and then she died. But then Edward was biting her everywhere. So that his venom, venom can go through so that she can turn a vampire. And so she died, but then the venom hit her blood and then she, in her veins. And she like became a vampire and she woke up and she was beautiful. Look at this cabin that Natalie booked. Oh my gosh. Welcome to the cabin. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. I like love, love, love it. How does this get washed up? I don't even understand. And this tree is huge. I am sitting inside a tree that's been washed up on the shore. We might sleep in here tonight. My only concern is look at the tide. There's Nails. If there's one thing I've learned on this coastal trip, the tide changes. I don't know if you know that, but it rises and lowers. Oh! <laughs> Did he get you? Nels was watching me and the water just came up way high. It's like starting to get in the tree. So we're not gonna sleep in here. Chad, what up, Richie? <laughs> How unreal is this? Richie's such a good sport. He still has a broken ankle. He's just like happy spirits always. It's starting to rain outside, but not in the tree. Not here. It's beautiful. Guys, go out and explore. If you don't have any plans to explore, go do it. I'm just like amped on this life right now because this, this is cool. Blew my mind. It's beautiful here. My, my, like, we got here last night and it was dark, so we didn't really see what was out on the coast. And then I see all these little islands out here. And then this tree, I don't know why, this tree is just made me happy. Oh, oh, no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Your, your handicap is okay? My handicap is okay. Alright, so it's been inside. Watch out, watch out. <laughs> Ooh, we gotta go. So, oh man, it's not going down. Okay, we gotta go. Ah! I really don't want to get these shoes wet. They're my only dry pair right now. I made it! Man, these colors are amazing. It's like Instagram world. 